JP the Tool Addict! Woo! How's it going? Man, this is, uh, we just got 12 inches of snow here. It has been a crazy week already. But I've got an awesome, awesome tool haul for you today. And that involves Tecton. That's right. Tech done. That's right. We've got a Tecton tool haul. And uh, I got also, I got picked up a new Kenefe. That's right. This is a K-Bar wrench knife. Uh, the part number on this one is a... Um, let me look here. This is a 1119. Pretty simple. K-Bar... It's my new knife. This is my new letter opener. Try to get this without. It's sharp. Super sharp. Stainless steel. High carbon. This thing is a bad mamber jamber. We'll take a look at it underneath the uh, the uh, light a little bit later. But it uh, comes with a nice sheath. Of course, I put a necktie or some par or paracord on there. But a uh, nice Tidex sheath. Clips in. We're going to open up the Tekken box. And we're going to show you what we got here. We got a big one, and uh, I'm not going to show you everything right now, but we're going to start off with some really good USA products, and uh, I think we're going to start off, oh Jesus, this is a big box, she's a heavy one, so I bought everything pretty much from USA made from Tekton, and uh, I'm just going to show you half of the, the, uh, half of the order right now, but uh, let me get this thing open here. Show you what I got here. I got a set of pin punches. And I, you know what? I like the no-frills packaging from Tekken. Um, you know, really good. Um, and, of course, their punches. Somebody had asked me last week on the on the live stream whether I liked it, what, what I thought was the best punches and chisels. But uh, I've never tried any of the Tekken ones. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at these. I just don't, I didn't have any roll pin punches. Scott, look at that. Just liquored and. Slicker and frogs here. Uh, we're going to open this up take a look at these. I'm going to turn you guys around here a little bit. But these are the pin punches. We'll look at these under the under the, the potato lens. <laughs> then the other thing that I got was this big box. And I want to say, I want to say these were, hold on, let me get the deal. Of course, they don't give me the price on them. But uh, this is the eight-piece roll pin punch set, the PNC 93001 if you want to order this set from Tekton. Tekton is no way a sponsor of mine. Um, I, I just bought these because they, they were, I think they were like 25, 30 bucks. Honestly, a killer deal for the set. Then I got the three-piece long cold steel. I was actually looking for one half-inch or uh, one-inch chisel. This is a 66506 I'm going to show you here. Comes in this big box here. See if I can get this. Whatever. Who cares? I'll, I'll get the, I'll get them tagged down there. And we're gonna show you half my Tekken order today, plus the K-Bar knife. That was one thing I got. But look at these chisels, guys. Three-piece set. I want to say 25, 30 bucks once again. Look at these. We're gonna open these up. I'm gonna spin the camera around here. We're gonna talk about these for just a second. So hang on. Go. Let's uh let's look at these pin punches here real quick. Get you under the the microscope here. <laughs> Did I get them the right way? Well, I'll let you take a look at these. Why did they, they got them backwards? This is the 730 seconds. USA Tekton 6607. And uh, these are roll pin punches. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> look at those things. These, these are really nice. Hardened steel. Now... Keep in mind, the ends on these are tempered, okay, but these ends are hardened, okay? And the reason they do that on punches is so that you don't chip or break off the ends, and that way we're hitting on them. So a punch is kind of unique, or a chisel, for that fact of the matter, is because the end has to obviously be harder than the side you're hammering on, because you don't want... And that's why I hear about people talking about mushrooming and whatnot. So if a cheap punch that's really cheap... We'll mushroom really bad right there, and that's what we'll talk. We'll find out. You'll find out that really cheap punchers will hunt mushroom because they're too soft. Okay, and we want them to mushroom a little bit, but you know what? That's not a main concern about this stuff. What may matters is we don't want this chipping and hurting anybody. 
you know, you don't want this thing smashing this in and then it hurts you. But uh, let's get some of the rest of these out here and take a look at them. These look of really good quality. They're USA made, guys, so um, really, you know. And I will tell you that Tectin is very transparent about what how, where they make their products. So quarter inch USA. Let's look at the little guy here. <clears throat> Under my beat, my meat hooks here. Three thirty seconds. This is the little guy right here. <clears throat> look at that. Just uh, just very nice punches, guys. Uh, for thirty dollars, USA made punches. Besides buying Mayhews, which obviously I have some Mayhews too, so. It's nice to have a variety so I can see I have some snap-ons. And uh, I can kind of see which ones and what I feel about them. But honestly, between SK snap-ons, I really haven't had a problem with too many of them. Not a huge punch user. Um, and I don't, you know, honestly, I haven't really needed that many roll pin punches ever. Uh, let's look at the real little tiny guy here. Wear safety goggles. I mean, the, the, the writing is obviously pretty clear to see. This is a 16th. This is the smallest one, 66061. You can see this thing is roughly just about the size of my finger. Just a little guy right here. Nice ball on there. Every one of them seem to be a really good quality. I can't say anything. I mean, they're straight. They're true. I don't see any anything that's really throwing it off. But uh, let me get these all laid out in the right order here so you can take a look at them. Uh, quarter inch. Get these all, these all lined up for you so you can take a look at them in a different, get them all lined up so we can take a shot, shot, see them the way they should be laid out. No pouches with these guys, nothing, no frills. That's what I kind of like about Tectin is, is they save you the money. By not doing all the packaging and all that crap. And just sell you the tools. And that's what matters. So let's look at these. There we go. Take a look at them. There, there they are. Look at that. Quarter inch. 736 seconds. 13, 3 sixteenths. 330 seconds. 7 eighths. 330 seconds. 530 seconds. 1 8th, 3 30 seconds, 5 64th, and your 1 16th. So that is the Tectin Roll Pin Punches, 100% USA made. Uh, I think these really look really, really nice, and I'm looking forward to ever having to use these. I probably could use these more, and honestly, the biggest thing I bought these for was because I have some gunsmithing. I wanted to need some roll pins for the smaller ones, and the set was only $30, so I just went ahead and bought the whole set, so... I was just looking and just took on. So now let's look at these. Once again, these bad boys. Let me open them up. Get the old the sleigh bar knife here. Let's look, let's look at that real quick. Here's the K bar up close so you guys can see it. Uh, this thing has got the, only New York. Look at the edge on this. Focus. This is a wrench knife. I don't know if I can get it to focus because of the shine. There we go. This thing's got a nice sharp edge. Let's open up the... Oh, cut my mat. She ain't no joke. Let's get this thing opened up here. Come on, little feller. There we go. Let's get these opened up. Look at these. These are big suckers here, so... I don't know if I'm going to be able to get them all on camera on the whole. That is uh, that is about 12 inches long. Let me get a measure, tape measure. All right, so there's a tape measure. Measuring to end. Yep, exactly one foot long. I believe it says that on there. They're one foot chisels or 12 inch chisels. So these are uh, these are some big suckers. Let me see if I can get a little bit better camera angle here. Try to get in. It's going to be hard. But look at these things. I mean... These things are beefy, but I wanted a one-inch cold chisel. So I looked at the Snap-On's got a crazy one. But I'll tell you what, for 30 bucks, guys, um, and I will put the link in the description for all these. These are going to be awesome chisels when you really want to pound on something. 
Uh, I don't know if this little guy will survive or whatnot. Nice wide tip. Let's look at the tip size on these. I believe these are about an inch wide. This one's an inch. This one's about a half inch. Or no. What is this one? Uh, maybe three, just about three quarter. And then we'll look at this guy right here. This has got to be like a half inch here. Yeah, about a half inch, half inch wide tip. So, foot long cold chisels, really nice, 100% USA made. Let's look at these. Once again, hardened steel. Look at the tips here on them. Now, obviously, this is a big chisel, so you're going to be doing some major, you know, smacking with this. But these are etched up here, just like the punches, and. Uh, these are stamped. Nope, those are etched too. One it says the size on there, one inch, twelve inches long. All these are exact same length. Hardened hardened tips. Or yeah, hardened tips, tempered ends. We don't want them to be hard. Remember what I said on the other ones? So that way they're softer. But uh I mean guys, USA made stuff for this cheap. I think sixty bucks is what I got into them. So look at the last little guy right here. Now, I have more Tekton tools coming in, and uh, honestly, you're going to be, I have a big, massive Tekton tool haul. I was going to do them all in one video, but I felt like I really wanted to showcase these because they were USA-made and showing the USA-made stuff, so I really wanted to talk about it and really let, them, let you take a good look at them, and uh, so that's the video I got for you today. Look forward to more Tekton tool hauls. We're going to talk about some more Tekton stuff I got. And uh, appreciate you guys watching. Remember, like, comment, share, subscribe. Ring that bell. Remember, keep your hands dirty and your money clean. Thanks for watching.